got a Tesla! We made it! Wow! Yeah! Come on, I'm actually excited. Come on. Hey, this is a sustainable flex. Eco-friendly flex. Wow! I was starving, now I'm eating till my belly full. From up north, we get cold, you need a heavy coat. Scared to end up on a shirt before I send a fold. Devil on my back, target on me, deadly it, toe. Play for keys, don't tweet. Don't play. It's not peace, don't speak. Don't 24, no sleep. This is real, no tweet. My bros for life, like. can't break this link. Family on my side, <laughs> baby, stay around me. Flex. I don't want no combo, I want checks. I don't want the second. Do you know how to drive this thing? Yeah. All right, there's no key, so how do you start this thing? <laughs> Where's the start button? There is no start button. How do you start it? You just put it in drive. You go, no, yeah, oh. there you go. Okay. Wow, you can't even hear anything. It's so smooth. Is it true these things are as fast as Ferraris and Lamborghinis? Yes, and I can show you on YouTube how they beat them. I just watched one Can today. we test it out? Oh, you can, yeah, you can go. Wow, oh my gosh, dude, that's like light speed. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drip, yeah, I'm fitted up. I'm in my car in the kitty, yeah. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bag. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Dude, this is so smooth. So, before we start the video, I want to preface it with some backstory so that you don't think that this is just an ego-tripping flex. Which, let's be real, it's kind of a flex. But all the things you post online that you're proud about is essentially a flex. But it doesn't mean that all the flex is a bad thing, especially when you know the meaning behind it. This one has a backstory. Will, look there. Hi, Wei Wei. Nung bata pa ako, I was obsessed with the concept of sustainability and I was doing everything I could to be environmentally responsible. Sa aming komunidad, sobrang importante ang kalikasan. It, it was almost as if it's part of our religion. This is a nice place to paint. Yeah. Yeah. And that meant preserving it at all costs. Generally speaking, it's California culture, you know, recycling, anti-global warming, green technology, that whole thing. And to give you guys perspective, kung gaano ka strict yung laws dito in California, you can get fined if you don't throw this in the recycle, if you don't recycle properly. Kung itapon ko to sa basura, 10,000 pesos yung multa hinko. Grabe. Pero hindi lang yan. Itlog shells. Kung itapon ko to sa basura, multo. Huh? Multo? Multa. Multa and multo, both. Okay, yeah. Kasi this is compost. It is the law na kailangan mo i-compost. Sibuyas, lemon, kamatis, cherries, major dick, kape, buto ng manok, baka, baboy. Lahat ng yan has to go in the compost. Sa tinatira ko in Makati, in my condo. Ay, andito sa condo ko sa Maynila, isang basura lang. Recycle, compost, lahat, just isa lang. There is only basura. That's it. Recycle, compost, every, everything just goes in basura. Wala nang iba. Pero dito, meron tatlong basurahan. Basura, recycle, and compost. And if you don't do it correctly, multa. Ayun, tignan mo, may kodigo ni Mudra dito para hindi kami tanga-tanga dito. Alam mo, kahit pinayong nanay ko, kahit taga bundok ng Mindoro, ever since I met her, when I came out of her sinapupunan, she's always been super strict in telling us, you Kahit, they don't have that where she's from. Hindi ko alam kung bakit ganun siya. Nung bata pa kami, if she finds this in the trash, Pinapokpok niya kami sa ulo. Alam mo kadalasan hindi ko mahilig sa mga patakaran kasi medyo pasaway ako. Pero itong patakaran na to, I love this and sana ganito sa buong mundo. Cause the world would be a lot cleaner and efficient and less sayang, di ba? And I hate making sayang. Ang dami kong sinayang. Bruh. It won't open. How do you open these? Oh, <laughs> How do you open this car, dude? The Tesla's so dumb. Oh wait, is he not? Oh, no one's in the car. Oh, it's doing self-parking right now. I didn't realize it's parking itself right now. 
So here is another cool feature is the self parking mode. As you can see, there's no one inside the car. He's controlling it all on his phone. <laughs> Look, there's no one inside. Can you open the window so it makes it look cool that there's no one there? Vent. Does that mean park? It's on vent? Way to no, park. if you hit vent, it, it'll it'll drop your windows like three or four inches. Oh. Hit vent. Oh. Look, it's parking by itself. It's parking. <laughs> there's no one inside. It's parking. That's the coolest thing ever. It's like a Batmobile. It says go to Target, which makes me a little nervous. <laughs> go to Target. Well, his says, no, it's his says come to me. Mine says go to Target. Where's the Target? <laughs> right, so we're going to make the car come to us. It's a remote control. Okay, ready? Valet parking, okay? I want a valet parking. I don't want to walk by the steps. I want the car to come to me. Look at the steering wheel. Oh my god, dude! Oh my god! Dude! It came, it came to you! It's better at parking than you, Mom! <laughs> oh my god! Seriously! It is, though, it is! <laughs> so, we're new Tesla owners. We don't know how to do all this stuff, which is why we have our aunts and uncles here playing with their cars who have, have had theirs forever. And they know how to make it summon, park itself, and drive itself. Look! Oh my god! Oh my god, dude, the dog's driving the car! <laughs> Who's driving? Who's driving? Oh. <laughs> oh my god! I just walked in behind you here with that sad look upon your face. I should have changed that stupid look. Look at the dog! <laughs> <laughs> dude, it's self drive. Even a dog can drive. Bukut sa bahay, we were being trained in the school system as early as I can remember nung five years old pa ako in kindergarten about the importance of the planet. Dun sa escuela, we would have field trips where we would go on hikes, we'd go to the beach, we learn about mga ibat ibang hayop, mga plants, and we were even tasked in removing all the invasive species and learning what are bad plants. And we're on our hands and knees just removing all the bad plants out of the ground. Manganon bagay. So fast forward to high school when the Toyota Prius came out. It was kind of the first car na ginagamit ng corriente, pero not fully corriente because it was a hybrid. But you started seeing these all around town and people were driving them. Kaso, nagiging pang nana yung peg. It started to be branded as, as a mom car. Kasi those were the only people driving the car, yung mga eco-conscious babae. Yung mga lalake, they just like being cool and doing cool stuff. Plus, the Prius had this weird boxy shape. It wasn't particularly cool, especially for young, dumb high school kids like myself. Turn that shit on! <laughs> Let's be real, napaka pange talaga yung design ng koche na yan. Now, dito sa California, you start driving at the age of 15 years old. And at 15 years old, bata ka pa, you're basically a little child. Nung isang araw, nakita ko yung pinsan ko, nagdadrive siya, and he looks like a 10 year old. You're like dude, 10 years old. Dude, have you christened his car <laughs> what yet? The heck? My 10 year old cousin is driving, dude. This is hilarious. So nangangarap, nangangarap. So nangangang, so nangangarap ng lahat ng mga bata at 15 years old of wanting a dream car since everyone's already driving and everyone wants, you know, a Lamborghini, Ferrari, yung mga European Astigna sports car. Pero ko, yung dream car ko was always a Tesla and most people didn't know what it was at the time kasi wala sila sa daan. They weren't even made yet. They were in the process pa of being made. Nung time na yan, it sounded like some futuristic sci-fi idea that the world would be filled one day with electricity cars and something straight out of a movie like Minority Report. Dad, do you remember when I was a kid and I super loved Tesla before Teslas even came out? I don't know. Mom, do you remember when I was a kid in high school and I super loved Tesla before they even made the cars and stuff? I don't know. You don't remember? Mm -mm. I don't even remember Tesla at all. You don't remember? No. Okay, no one remembers anything from 15 years ago, but... Dude, I don't even remember Tesla being a thing when we were in high school. <laughs> Dude, that's exactly what mom said. Yeah, it wasn't a thing, but I knew about them. Anyway. Okay, so regardless of my family's forgetfulness, fan ako before they even knew it existed. 
kaya medyo big deal to. Na lala ko sitting in my econ class and pinag-iisipan ko kung anong dapat kong gawin sa mga pera ko from all my trabaho, summer jobs, and I had $10,000 and I wanted to invest it sa mga stocks and stuff because I was interested, getting interested in stocks and finances and yung mga grown-up stuff, di ba? That's when yung tropa ko, si Connor O'Hara Baker, he advised me to invest my money into this new electric car company called Tesla. Sabi niya, this was going to be the first cool electric car. It's going to be like the electric version of Ferraris and, and Lamborghinis. And this isn't too far from the truth. Mas affordable sila sa mga Ferraris, but nung time na yan, like I said before, the only kind of electric car at the time was the Prius. And it wasn't even a fully electric car because it was half gas, half electric. But the Tesla would be the first all electric, non hideous car that would make electric cars cool. At importante ang pagiging cool kasi people aren't gonna do anything or buy anything unless they perceive it to be cool. In turn, this would be a huge step in influencing green technology and the shift from oil dependency to fully electric. Freedom from oil dependency meant not having to pay so much for gas. Which at the time were at record high prices because of the Iraq war. And speaking of war, maybe we wouldn't have had to invade the Middle East if the United States wasn't so dependent on oil. But more than anything, this is how humans will prevent global warming and save planet Earth by utilizing solar technology and electric automobiles. Ito yung mindset ng 15-year-old radical social justice warrior planetarian Will Tasevich. Do I still think this way? Well, as you age, you realize life gets complicated. Not everything's black and white. But I'm a storyteller and 15-year-old Will makes the story sound a lot more cool. So we're just gonna stick with that narrative. Pero, whether you're a 15-year-old environmentalist or a 50-year-old who hates Elon Musk, like my dad, either way, you're being eco-friendly while looking cool. Yeah. Am I right? Look at all those cameras. How many cameras do you need? Four or five. It's a vlogging car. You know, we can even play that here. <laughs> oh my god, it's not that fine. Okay, boomer. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this is another feature I like about the Tesla is that everything is just made of glass. So you can see everything throughout the whole car. That makes it pretty futuristic, don't you think? Yeah. Wow, look at all this fog. It's so mm -hmm. thick. 420, baby. Huh? It's May 28th. <laughs> Dashboards no longer exist. There's none of that anymore. Now they just have a giant TV, a giant iPad here in the middle. It has the speed that you're going, speed limit. It somehow knows the speed limit wherever you are. It shows the battery. See, the car is basically like a huge iPhone. And I'll put it on. Okay, now I'm gonna put it on self-drive. Okay. So you regulate the speed by this little thumb wheel right here. My feet are tight. It's driving itself. So is it able to turn on its own, like it's turning? Yeah, it's following the path of the road right now. And we're going to do a test up here to see if it actually does what it's supposed to do. If you look here, we're coming into this town. So we're going to see if it's, if it's going to negotiate this town by self-driving. Oh my god, it turns on its own. It's turning on its own. <laughs> That's cool. Honey, can I have a beer? Joke long. <laughs> Dude, that is insane. What is? Look, you can, there's cars that oh you can God. see on the map next to us. <laughs> and then there were cars that were like passing by. You can even tell if they're a sedan and a freaking SUV and like a Hummer. There's an SUV there, there's an SUV there. There's a sedan in front, there's a sedan. Elon Musk is the goat, dude. It's crazy, look, you can see the cars right behind us. Wow, can you like, yes. Ooh. No, you're gonna get a sweaty bull dip. No, I don't need a heater. I thought you're cold. Yeah. Here, come to me. Oh, well, stop. <laughs> Kid. Can you honk? Yeah. 
<laughs> but you, wait, what else can you do here? No, just okay. Just just keep your camera on and knock it off. Parang bata si Mimi. Parang malit kang bata. Parang musbus na bata. It's an iPhone on wheels. It is. Oi, my ini chupit ko. I don't want. Hey, they turn off that heater. My bullet. Okay, it's off. No, it's on. Why don't you put it on, Will? Sa bata na to ko ikbit to. Although it's probably heat therapy, you know? This car is fun. Let's <laughs> let's do more stuff. What else can you do here? Does this thing open up? Let's just start pressing buttons and see if... No, you just I keep can. your hands away from the controls. <laughs> yeah, I literally don't know how to get out of this car. Wait, Dad, we're stuck. I don't know how to get out of the car. I have pushed the button. Wait, Mom, hold on. Wait, Mom. No, Mom, Mom, hold on. Okay, hold on. All right, let me try it, okay? Like, yelling at me is not gonna make a difference. We can't figure out. <laughs> but why does the window go down? Yeah, it will so, come so it up again. So it seals the car, it, will it come unseals up it, you get out. And I can't figure out how to open the door. The reason is because it goes up underneath oh, and seals it. Right? <laughs> Family's back, dude. Drama rama. Now what are you doing? You look like a kung fu mudra. Oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>